Okay, this is the outside stuff we're growing. I put these things in a year and a half ago. They were small. They really grew in a year and a half and spread. And then here, let's put this in today. It's some kind of lime leaf. And then back there is a lime tree. It, I don't think it's going to live, but I don't know. And the grass is all cut today thanks to this man here. The grass cutter for me. He carries that like a weed whacker, but it's got a solid blade on it. Looks like a good way to hurt yourself, really. Yep, there's my grass cutter. <laughs> Going home for shower and then come back for dinner. Here's uh, chili peppers. A couple little ones on there. This is a mango tree that's for some reason not getting any fruit. And then as we go around to the back, oh, here's more chilies. Yeah. See red ones on there. A couple more. Another plant. And around the back, we have okra. I don't really, not really a fan, but my wife likes it. I have three okra plants and another okra plant. This is another lime leaf. It's kaffir lime leaves. They use that a lot for cooking. This one I'm not sure because I think my grass cutter put that in while I was gone. This I think is papaya. No fruit for this. It's just not in long. Lemongrass, that's doing real good. This is a banana tree. And he says there'll be bananas on there in six months, but we'll see. This is, I believe this is star fruit. I'm not sure. That's another banana. And then over here is some mint. And some lettuce and of course more chili peppers can't be in Thailand without having lots of chili peppers this one is I'm not sure <laughs> I guess I don't I ought to know what I'm what's growing in my own yard but I don't more chilies but this is the big thing the mango tree that actually has mango on it and a couple little ones starting thinking maybe this year we might be able to eat some mangoes off the tree and that's pretty much it for the for the garden tour got uh, that's our closest houses in the back yeah that's the water tank that that helps keep the pressure up by keeping that tank full and then there's a pump that pumps it in so that way you get better pressure in the house and over there there was supposed to be two houses going in there to be for sale but I'm not sure there hasn't been any progress lately that one back there was just finished not long ago still have the same mountain view on those sides okay yeah. and over there's our car and the boss doing the sweeping she thinks she's the boss i don't know if she is or not and there's wait, there is a flower on here on the one of the originals it's actually blooming right now a little bit and more houses up there that are just there's six houses there and there's gonna be you see the guys in the green shirt up there if i can zoom in yeah, the guys in the green shirt, they're working on another new one. It's Sunday and they're working on a house. It's hard to believe. Get up a little higher on the step. You can see a little bit better from where they're working. Yeah, and this is, this is what I really like. It's cloudy today, so it's not showing, but it's really good mountain view out there on a good day. And then on the backside, you got a real good sunset most of the time. Thank you.
anyway that's about it. that's the outside tour of the gardens if you want to call them that